mean, one way they went right into an underhook naturally. You know, that's great. That's what you want to do, right? Hand fighting is fighting to your ties, right? Whatever tie you want to score from, you want to work to, right? So I'm making contact with him, and then I'm, I'm working to my tie. Like I'm circling, banging, push, snapping. Oh, there's an underhook. Boom, I got it, right? Very rarely can we go ready, wrestle, and I can just step to an underhook. Like that's not going to happen. Right? I got to move him, get him out of position, get his elbows to come up. Then I can dig an underhook. Um, some of you guys might like chopping, posting, whatever. Everything I'm showing leads into that stuff that your coaches are probably teaching you all already. Right? So this is just a system of getting them, moving them, wearing them out, wearing them down. Um, if you guys haven't noticed, um, your partner's probably not working you hard enough. But right now, your, your lower back and your thighs should be burning a little bit. You should be a little tired. Tomorrow, when you wake up for school, you should feel it. If you don't, your partner's not beating you up enough. He's not hand fighting hard enough. He's not pulling on your arms hard enough. He's not snapping hard enough, right? This should. And in a match, that's what you'll do to a guy. You'll wear down his thighs, you'll wear down his lower back. How strong is your stance going to be if your legs are weak and your lower back's tired? Any feedback? I need feedback. Not very strong, right? No trick questions, promise you. I will lead you to the correct answer every time. So just whatever you're thinking, yell it out, and it'll probably be right, okay? That's what I'm trying to do, right? I started out, everything set starts for a purpose, right? I, I'm trying to wear them out, get them in bad position, so my attacks work, okay? If his legs and lower back aren't tired today, you're not doing a good job of the hand fighting. You just need to be pulling harder, you need to be circling more, Circling will add to your strength, right? And, and my, my legs and core are stronger than his head and arms. So if I use my motion to, to wear his arms down too and his head by circling, it's just gonna make me that much better, okay? So we're just gonna add again to what we're doing to give you another scenario. So now I'm circling both ways, I'm pushing, I'm snapping. And what I'm gonna do, everybody make this shape with your hand like a check mark, right? Some people say B for victory, or whatever. For victory. Right, just like this. So when I snap, right, I'll go through the whole system, but when I snap, I have them underneath here. I'm gonna use this hand to push his elbow in, and I wanna try to put my head behind his shoulder, right here, okay? And then I'm just gonna circle, because right now, I, right, I could shoot a double leg, I could shoot a high crotch, I could go to a single. All my attacks are open from here, but today's not single, double, high crotch day. It's hand fighting day. So we're gonna to continue to hand move. So when I get my head here, I'm just gonna circle. And he's gonna to try to square up with me, okay? So we wanna to get to where we beat the shoulder during this. So the whole drill, touch the mat, close the gap, feet him inside, bang, bang, push, snap. And now I'm gonna make my hand beat the shoulder. Put my head, uh, let me explain that better. I'm, I'm snapping to here, right? Got my elbows pinched. I'm gonna rotate my hand to here, push his arm in, beat his shoulder with my head. That's really important. I don't want my head back here like this, all right? I'm already over top of him. My head's in that position. I'm just dropping it to the side, right here, right? And then I'm gonna circle. I'm gonna move my feet. Don't right? let go of the arm. Yeah, see, I keep my hand on the arm here as I'm circling, I keep this. I don't want him to pull his arm back because then that's his defense for my shot, right? I want to clear the elbow and keep my hand on it. So I push, snap, rotate my hand from like the armpit to here, push the elbow in, beat him with my head, and now I'm circling, okay? Let's get that step down. Start from the beginning. One time all the way through, Touch the mat, close the gap, beat them inside. Circle one, two, three, circle one, two, three, push, snap, beat the elbow, circle. All right? Partner, be a good partner, circle and square up. Okay? Let's try it. Three, two, one.